Good day, ladies and gentlemen. While commemorating the anniversary of the Universal Declaration of Human Rights, we must at the same time ask ourselves whether after the passage of 60 years since the Declaration, distinctions of color, creed, sex, religious or social origin still impede the realization of the rights and freedoms enshrined in the Declaration. The answer, unfortunately, is yes, they do. The gap between the rich and the poor and the developed and the underdeveloped has only grown larger. Half of humanity comprising of women remain the victim of gender bias. They are by and large stereotyped to subordinate roles that deny them the right to realize their full potential in the world as human beings. Equal pay for equal work is the exception, not the rule. Torture and degrading punishments are yet to be banished. The right of a fair and impartial trial does not extend to every inhabitant of the world. The rights under Articles 20, 22 to 27 remain only on paper. Much remains to be done. On this day, let us recommit ourselves to the Universal Declaration of Human Rights and pledge to work together for